what the mercy of God can do. If you knew me then, you'd believe me now. Turn my whole life upside down. Took the old and he made it new. Just what the mercy of God can do. I'm alive to tell the story how I've overcome His goodness and mercy and the power of the blood. I'm so glad that my freedom wasn't based on what I his goodness and mercy and the power of the blood I'm alive to tell the story how I've overcome it's his goodness and mercy and the power of the blood I'm so glad that my freedom wasn't based on what I his goodness and mercy and the power of the blood oh, yeah. oh, your mercy the mercy of God can do if you knew me then you believe me now he turned my whole life upside down he took the old and he made it new just what the mercy of God can do story how I've overcome it's his goodness and mercy and the power of the blood I'm so glad that my freedom wasn't based on what I've done it's his goodness and mercy and the power Father, we worship you, we magnify you, we thank you for that wonderful time of worship that we've had. And Lord, as we get into the word, we ask that you come into this place, oh God, surround us and reveal uh, to us your word as we read today. And Lord, we pray as we fellowship, Lord, minister to us wherever we are. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for joining us for our prayer and devotions this morning. And this week we have been focusing on the fear of the Lord. And this fear is not that we run away from him, but we run towards him because of his power and his might. And this morning our focus is the fountain of life. God, the fountain of life. And the Bible tells us in Jeremiah chapter 17, verse 13, O Lord, the hope of Israel, all who abandon you will be shamed. Those who turn away on earth will be written down because they have abandoned the Lord, the fountain of living water. So God is described as the fountain of living water. And today, as we focus on that, when we look at the actual fountain that we know that are in the park sometimes, there's always a refreshing. It never runs dry. And that's the same with our God. God, in his presence, there's fullness of joy. There's peace everlasting. There's happiness. In him, we live and move and have our being. He is the fountain of living water. 
And the Bible also tells us in Proverbs chapter 14 and verse 27. And this we read from the English Standard Version. It says, the fear of the Lord is the fountain of life that one may turn away from the snares of death. And so God being the fountain of life means we run to him each and every time. And as we run to him, we run away from death. Yeah, because he is the fountain of living water. And so this morning, as we pray, let's turn to God and ask him to reveal to us who he is so that each day as we look to him, as we yearn to and desire to just fellowship with him, we'll find him. And he is faithful. He is faithful to reveal himself to us. And he desires that we look to him. So just go before the Lord. Go before the Lord right now and call out to him. Call out to him, the fountain of life. The fountain of life. Call out to him. Heavenly Father, we worship you. We lift up your name. We glorify you. We thank you for such a wonderful time. And thank you because of your word. That Lord, the fear of the Lord is a fountain of life. And Lord, we thank you that you are the fountain of life that in you we live and move and have our being in you we find our sustenance lord you sustain us each and every day each and every time and so lord this morning as we cry out to you as we lift up your name father we exalt you for who you are oh god you are yahweh you are the alpha and the omega you are the first and the last you're the beginning and the end Lord, we thank you that we can run to you, our present help in time of need. Lord, we thank you that you are the fountain of life. And we ask that the times where we have taken you for granted, God, forgive us. Forgive us, oh Lord. We ask that you rejuvenate that fire of salvation in us, oh God. The Lord, we shall rejoice in salvation that in this work we shall know that lord you are for us father we thank you that we can look to you we thank you that we can run to you for help we thank you that you can run to you in times of joy in times of peace in times of celebration in times of failure in times of tragedy in times of challenges oh god we can run to you you are our present help O king of glory Lord, we thank you that just as the fountain does not run dry, oh God, that in you we find refreshing, in you we find freshness, in you we find newness, oh God. In you, Lord, we find peace, in you we find love, in you we find joy, oh God. And Lord, we look to you, O King of glory. Thank you that, Lord, we shall walk in the fear of the Lord. We shall walk in the fear of the Lord. And Lord, your promise is that as we do so, you who is the fountain of life, as we look to you, God, we turn away from the snares of death that the enemy brings. For the enemy's aim is to steal, kill, and destroy. But Lord, we choose you. You are the giver of life. You are the fountain of life. You sustain us each and every day, O oh God. And Lord, we thank you. We thank you for your word. We thank you for your word, O King of Glory. And so, Lord, we are in awe of your goodness. We are in awe of your wonder. We are in awe of your love upon us. We glorify you, Lord, and we lift up your name. And this we pray, believing and trusting in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Thank you for joining us for our prayer and devotion this morning. And we pray that you'll keep holding on to the fear of the Lord, for he is the fountain of life. May God bless you and have a wonderful day ahead. Amen. I'm alive to tell the story How I've overcome 
His goodness and mercy and the power of the blood. I'm so glad that my freedom wasn't based on what I've done. His goodness and mercy and the power of the blood. I'm alive to tell the story how I've overcome. It's His goodness and mercy and the power of the blood. I'm so glad that my freedom wasn't based on what I've done. It's His goodness and mercy and the power What the mercy of God can do If you knew me then You believe me now He stood my whole life upside down He took the old And he made it new Just what the mercy of God can do tell the story how I've overcome it's his goodness and mercy and the power of the blood I'm so glad that my freedom wasn't based on what I've done it's his goodness and mercy and the power His goodness and mercy and the power of the blood. It's His goodness. And